Hello there, everybody. My name is Bird Star. Sorry I couldn't post it in the last few days. Um, I was playing Skyrim. I mean, a lot. A lot of Skyrim. I mean, like, six, seven hours. Like, re basically recording. Um, was just went over my head. Uh, so, yeah. In today's video, we'll be talking about uh, Pokemon number 612 hackers. Being that I did not record Wednesday, which is for Pokemon, uh, Thursday, and hopefully Friday. Well, technically, it is Friday, so I would have to do three videos. Um, hopefully, Pokemon and gaming. Uh, gaming will be Necro Potter, as always. Um, as for now, uh, let's get this party started, so let me just get into my application because my tablet, the battery is dead, so I'm gonna use my handy dandy iPhone. Excuse me. Haxorus, there we go. Uh, Haxorus is pure dragon type, it's known as an axe draw. Basically, his jaw literally looks like an axe. Basically, that's why his name is Haxorus, you know, because it looks like a dinosaur and an axe, basically, so it's Hax, Axe, or us, basically. Um, it actually looks pretty cool. Um, actually, draw. Yeah. Which looks pretty OP, so if it hits you, it may chop off your head or something, because obviously it's, it's draw is like an axe. His generation is 5, his, his egg group is Monster Dragon, his capture is 45, Where do you think you're going? his effort value is 3 times attack, wow, super powerful, and his gender ratio is 50 male, 50 female, and his Pokedex entry says, they are not kind, but they can be, they are kind, but can be relentless, when defending territory. Oh, they're kind. So basically they're nice, but if you threaten their territory or their children or anything, they will come after you. They challenge falls with tusks that can cut steel. As for its shiny, is pure black and, and it basically stays the same with that. There you go. Sorry. There we go. Its base stats must be phenomenal because since it's a dragon, it would be extremely overpowered. Uh, and one more thing, guys, I'm actually gonna be building a dragon neck pretty soon. Um, first, I would have to buy um, Rainbow Energy because Rainbow Energy is always best with dragon type because being that dragons use multiple multiple attacks and stuff well for the pokemon card game because it, it has fire electric water a combination of different energies that you need so basically um the more colorless energy i mean not colorless what was i saying the more rainbow energies you have, it basically replaces any type of energy, so that's a good thing. Um, as for its base stats, its HP is 76, which is okay. Its attack, 146, whopping. Um, its defense, 90, that's decent. Special attack, 60. If only there was a dragon that had, you know, good special attack and good attack and defense. You know, being, you know, I, I probably would draw something like that, like a, like a type of dragon that actually has good attack defense, special attack, and special defense. Speed is okay, but I, if they had those four, it would be a perfect Pokemon. You know. Uh, his special attack is 60, 
and the special defense 70. Uh, his speed is 97, making a total of 540. It evolves from Fracture at 48. Uh, as for its ability, Mold Baker, it bypasses target's ability if they could hinder or prevent a move. Uh, rivalry increases damage inflicted to 1.5 against Pokemon of the same gender, but decreases damage to 0.75 against the opposite gender. And the hidden ability is unknown. Prevents opposing Pokemon from eating health daily. Uh, as for its moves upon leveling up. Level 1 Dragon Rage. Wait, what? That's impossible. It's probably Egg Moves. Uh, level 4 Leer. Level 7 Assurance. Level 10 Dragon Rage. Oh, huh, what? Okay. Dual Chop 13. Scary Face 16. Slash 20. Full Swipe 24, which is a good move. For weakening Pokemon, you know, down to 1 HP, which is good. Especially with Hacturus, it would knock out most Pokemon, unless it's fighting against a fairy type, which is not good. Dragon Claw 28, Dragon Dance 32, which is also a good move. It, its attack and, and defense go up, I believe. Uh, performs it. Uh, it raises with attack and speed. Oh, interesting. Attack and speed. So basically, it raises attack and, and its speed too. So could be pretty good if you use it in battle, you know, like um, competitively and stuff like that. Part 36, Dragon Pulse 42, Sword Stance 50, which is another good move. So if you if you use Swords Dance and Dragon Dance, woo, it'll. The Sword Dance basically it raises its attack stat by a lot. I mean, drastically. Sharply raises the user attack stat. Um, level 58 Guillotine, which is a one hit KO. If it hits, it's basically just 5 points for... It's a basically a 1 hit KO towards any Pokemon. Uh, Outrage level 66. Wow! It does 120 damage after each turn. Jesus Christ! Sorry God, but yeah. Wow, that is... So, if... A, basically, if he uses Outrage, he'll most likely one hit kill everybody. And Giga Impact level 74. The user charges at the target using every bit of its power. The user can't move after one turn. It's super, It's basically like... Uh, Uh, not Solar Beam, um, Hyper Beam, it's just like Hyper Beam is, it's just a physical move, because Hyper Beam is a special, um, yeah, let's, let's get to name origins and stuff, and what he is, he kind of looks like a dinosaur, to be honest. Where do you think you're going?
kind of playing are going to be... Should be somewhere around here. Somewhere. Just give me a second. Name origins. Axorus is a combination of hack, axe, and Saurus. Okay. Where do you think you're going? So hack, axe, Saurus. Haxorus, basically. So basically hacks. You know, it's a cut off. Or cut down. And Saurus literally means lizard. Uh, I know it. It was a type of dinosaur. Weird. They would call it a dragon, but okay. What I oh a battle strategy. Almost forgot that. There's not much to say besides Hacturus could be incredibly strong. Uh, just give me a second to go back to Wait, let me just spin that. Okay, I believe has to be great. Yeah, got it. So, I always mark it down just in case I forget. Usually, uh, there we go. Sorry about that. So yeah, let's go on to battle strategy. Boom. Okay, so it's it's tier is U U, which is underused and. Oh, here, he goes with overview. Um, Haxorus is a threatened ship because of its dragon typing enormous attacks that enacts us to two boosting movements, dragon, dragon dance and sword dance, and a good coverage option. Its speed tier is decent, but it leaves it prone to revenge killed by common choice card Pokemon. Haxorus is heavily relying on outrage for damage. Its bulk is average at best, but its dragon typing, typing gives it resistance that help it find setup opportunities. Mold Breaker allows it to defeat Pokemon that rely on unaware to stop setup keepers. As for the name of the strategy, it's called Dragon Dance. His first move is Dragon Dance, second move is Outrage, third move is Earthquake, and fourth move is either Poison Jab or Iron Tail. Um, you could either equip it with a Life Orb, Lumberry, or Dragonium Z. Its ability Mold Breaker. His nature is Jolly or Adamant, which is an attack booster. And his EVs are 252 attack, 4 special defense, and 250 defense. As for me, would I use it? Yeah, it looks actually pretty cool. And it could be pretty decent, you know, for, for using in a Pokemon game. Or... So yeah, guys, that does it for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.